What's going on guys and welcome back to my channel And today we got another special episode We definitely gotta talk about the Hana Hana no Mi's Awakening Which is the flower flower fruit And what I think that awakening is gonna be So stay tuned So first let me get this out of the way Some people believe that the demon fluors Whatever that Nico Robin did Where she turned into She had her copy of herself turned into a gigantic demon And basically the clutch was her awakening To me I don't think that is And there's a few reasons why One she has a Promethea type devil fruit so if what they're saying is true, Promethea type devil fruits affect their surrounding areas. That one doesn't really affect the surrounding area. Now mind you, most of her attacks you know, come out of the ground and stuff like that and affect the surrounding area. But I think because it doesn't, it doesn't really fit the awakening style of a Paramecia type. And two, um, I think Oda is trying to do this whole God thing with his characters. Obviously, Luffy's awakening was Nika the Sun God. I think, you know, with Zoro, he's, le he's leaning into the King of Hell type thing. So, going with that, I have my own idea of what I think the Hana Hana no Mi awakening would be. So, that being said, I started looking into gods that have multiple arms that could kind of fit the billing. And for me, I think Nico Robin's Prometheus type Delphru is going to be her calling out a bunch of Shivas. Obviously, she was a Hindu god um, that's usually depicted with four to six arms and you know it kind of fits the billing and I know people are gonna be like well why would he use you know Shiva in this situation if you notice you know he went out of his way to kind of get characters from all over the world all different backgrounds all different you know ideologies and everything like that even with the characters that he created in the show he got references from pop culture and all that stuff so I think he will also do the same with religions he probably will get gods from all different types of religions and for Robin which I think fits well is Shiva. Now, obviously, you know, some people depict Shiva as a male, female, whatever. But, you know, obviously, it's a god with multiple arms. And I think if she were to unlock her awakening, multiple Shivas would either sprout from the ground or come down, whichever way you want it. They will basically surround the enemy and there'll be no way to get away from the arms and legs of this uh, god. So that's why I think Nico Robin's Hana Hana no Mi awakening would be. Thanks for watching the video. And if you, you know, have a different opinion on what the Hana Hana no Mi awakening would be, put it in the comment section. And if you enjoy this video, watch the next video that just popped up.